Hello folks, the little one or two minute shaky phone footage clip that you're about to be subjected to has taken about six months of hard persistence and uh, not just by myself but by the people that have assisted me uh, to make it happen. Uh, due to that fact, I would like to celebrate. I would like to do that in the following way. I would like you who are watching this to go find yourself a copy of the ACDC song Back in Black. Whatever format best suits you, you, you go and find that and pause me, come back and when I give you the 3, 2, 1 countdown you crank that up as loud as you can tolerate it now i would of course have uh, put this as a soundtrack to the video but poochube and their minions would have a absolute conniption if i were to do that so i need to leave that in your capable hands so that's it folks pause Go find ACDC back in black. Okay, you have it. So here we go. Three, two, one. Okay. We're, uh, we're getting gas here, folks. I literally just came up here today to do a can log uh, to prove that we wouldn't, you know, to get some data to see why we weren't able to use Ionity chargers. <laughs> this sucker's getting gas. We're even, yeah, we're starting to roll back now on the power because we're, uh, approaching full charge but we're we're getting gas ah. ha -ha. what the Sam Hill okay uh Let's see what happens when we press stop. Wow. Charging stopped with the plug back. I can do that. OMG. So folks, uh, we just got gas here at Ionity uh, for the first time since very early January, or not early January, early June of this year, uh, 2021. Uh, we've been experiencing continual problems trying to charge at, these are in fact ABB char chargers. Um, they just would not initiate uh, communication with the limb and we traced that down to being that the limb was failing to send one of the last uh, sl slack responses uh, during the initial CCS uh, handshaking. Um, and I couldn't get to the bottom of that. And I came up here uh, today just to get some can logs, which I thought would be just, you know, a little bit of a diagnostic tool to uh, help me figure out uh what was going on here anyway um whenever i would plug in the car i would get this um 
message on the screen here that would say charging is delayed until power is available now that doesn't actually mean that uh, it just literally means that there's no high level communication going on between the car and the um, charging station uh, so I plugged in the car here I had the laptop running uh, logging can which is a good thing as we can find out what actually happened uh, I plugged in the, the car the screen came came up with charging is delayed until power is available so I just walked back to the front of the car just to check the laptop was still logging and the next thing I hear thump thump and the jet engine sound of the uh, charger starting to spin up I don't know what in the hell is going on here. So I grabbed the phone and shot that little bit of amateur hour footage that you've just seen. Um, so yeah, it, it looks like we've uh, it looks like we're getting proper communication now with our Ionity charging or ABB Ionity charging stations again. Um, what is interesting? is that I was up here yesterday and one of the stations was actually hung uh, with a, it looked like, looked like it had hung during the Linux booting process. Uh, so I did get a picture of that. I'll try and stick it in here. And I noticed just now when I, go, when I got here that there's some new stickers on the stations here, just QR codes and things saying co-financed by the, connecting europe facility of the european union whatever that means uh so i'm wondering if our stations here have had a little software upgrade or even a hardware upgrade for themselves so i imagine i'll be back here with the logic analyzer wired up to my second limb so we can get some uh wireshark p caps of the ethernet comes and see what is actually happening now but yay happy days it looks like um we're back on the ionity abb bandwagon here folks um now the only thing that i did between last test here and today is i stripped out i'd say about two meters of kind of surplus superfluous wiring um between the charge port and the limb so i kind of chopped it all down got rid of a load of joins in it all that kind of thing so maybe that had an effect but seeing those stickers on there now and that one hung yesterday mm, it tells me it's probably more to do with uh what went on here at the station so folks i leave that there uh i'll leave you there a little bit of an impromptu one uh, but super happy to see that fu functioning as always don't forget to dislike give the old thumbs down do not share this crap with anyone they will not thank you for it if you do and most of all if you're somehow subscribed for pete's sake unsubscribe from this loser channel also uh don't check the links in the description for patreon paypal open inverter forum and all stuff like that because they're just not interesting and if you financially support me i'll just do more of this junk so all right i'll leave you there folks and until next time happy ionity ccs charging <laughs>